everyone and welcome to another edition of Cooking on the Lake. I am your host Brian Peacock and today we're going to demonstrate on how to make a classic chicken Caesar salad. This happens to be one of my favorite Caesar salads so hopefully by the end of this episode it will become one of your favorites as well. It's a very simple salad to make. It is good for lunch, dinner and even a starter before an entree. So it really can go at any time during the day for any meal. Before we start mixing, I'd like to talk about some of the ingredients that you're gonna to need to complete this salad. First, you're gonna need some chopped up romaine lettuce. It's very simple. You just chop the romaine lettuce down to little bite-sized pieces. You're gonna need some freshly grated Parmesan cheese. You're gonna need some classic Caesar dressing. You're gonna need some homemade croutons. And you're also gonna need some baked chicken. The chicken takes about 15 to 20 minutes in the oven. It'll be nice and tender and very juicy in the inside, which is perfect for this salad. The croutons, if you're unfamiliar with them, you can actually purchase in a supermarket, but I highly recommend that you make your own. All you have to do is get your favorite bread, cut it into little cube-sized pieces, add a little oil and your favorite seasonings, and toast them for about 15 to 20 minutes or until they're golden brown. Now this is not a very complicated salad to make, and it is also very delicious. So why don't we get started on mixing and um, we'll go from there. First what you'll have to have is a pair of tongs and a mixing bowl. And what you would want to do next is add just a little bit of Parmesan cheese. You don't want to go too, too heavy in the beginning because at the end you're going to actually add the rest of it. Next you're going to need about four tablespoons of classic Caesar dressing. I'm going to add that right to the bowl. Croutons are my favorite part of this salad, so I like to go a little bit heavy. You can put as many in as you like, and if you don't want to put in as many at all, you don't have to. It's really up to your preference. And it can also mean up to your guests. After you've mixed those ingredients, what you want to do is give it a good mix. Really get that dressing spread around the lettuce. You want to make sure every bite you take has a flavor as the first one. Now when you're done with that, just take some on each plate. We have some nice portions here. It's not too, not too heavy, not too overwhelming. It's uh, something that'll actually leave some space for, um, for other meals in mind. Next, you have your baked chicken. I like to slice mine because it gives it a nice look on the plate. A lot of people like to cube theirs and mix them up like the crouton, but I think the sliced chicken really puts a nice look on this salad. And if you don't mind, can you please come in and take a look at the presentation of these plates, please? Now here we have the classic romaine, the classic croutons, and the sliced chicken. And the Parmesan cheese that has to finish off the salad, you can sprinkle it right on top. Ladies and gentlemen, this is how you do it. This is a classic Caesar salad. I am your host, Brian Peacock, and I'd like to thank you for joining me on another edition of Cooking on the Lake. You have yourself a nice evening.